Hi guys, I'm continuing with my Deathless Bosses Down series and now I'm up to Lilindre and she's a pretty tough boss and once again I'm not using Nullify so it makes it a longer fuller fight and anyway she was immune to magic but I wasn't going to use it anyway. So I've got my three high dark fires, two are at maximum and the other one's at about 75,000 and also my maximum rare attack gem. So without nullify you can still get 10% of your dark fire damage so I could still get a fair amount of attack there. But with Nullify, the bosses are down really fast for me, so it wouldn't be much of a fight to show. And I'm setting this up as a new challenge on my forum, Tamil Channel Forum, and it will be in the Skills Club soon, and it's called Nullified. And you can choose to do it against the Deathless bosses or the Normal Mode bosses. There'll be two categories and it's likely will include Reef as well so that's going to be really dodgy <laughs> when I get to Reef which will be quite soon I think. So I couldn't make any mistakes in this fight as I'd already used up my second chance with a Titan earlier on and the way the second chance works is it applies for that whole scene not every Titan so when you arrive at this part when you're up on the roof you've got one extra second chance for those three titans including the boss so it's not a second chance for every titan to fight i'd been hit by an mx ninja right at the beginning so i couldn't make any mistakes with this lilindra and once again i refresh my memory of her step backs with my step backs video and i've put a link to it in the description under this video so you'll see I'm getting a bonus combo every hit again, like I was with Cyrus, and that's because I'm using Issa's Turian with two bonus combo minus one gems equipped. And she has a few weapons where you can do this. With Jewel, there's the Snicket, the Sinestra, and the Aegis Tawny item, the Winterborn. And also with her light weapon, the Blade of Heaven, that one also you can get a bonus combo every hit again with two bonus combo minus one gems equipped and what those gems do is they take off the last two bonus combo arrows and the ones that are left with those weapons i mentioned you can just swipe in one direction and you'll get the bonus combo every hit and the direction depends on the arrow I have got a video explaining it more thoroughly so check out the link in the description under this video as I have been asked about it again recently and I did mention it in my fight with Alsar but you really need to look at the video to see it more thoroughly. And also with this fight I was going for parry breaks although dodge breaks are longer if you've got titan break gems equipped. However I find that with the parry breaks you know where you stand with how long your attack break window is because it lasts for as long as that little symbol is on the screen and once the symbol disappears then you can stop fighting and I really didn't want to get hit with these deadly bosses and I found that I would get hit when I swiped too many times like if I'd done a dodge break and my break had actually finished and I did that extra swipe that's when I'd get hit straight after and that's what can happen when the Titan blocks your hit because your attack break has finished it's very easy to get hit straight after that so I was going for parry breaks so that I knew I would finish and not get hit at the end of my attack break However, I didn't get hit and Lilindre is down and I've got to say I find Lilindre with Issa one of the hardest bosses to fight and of course Wreath is very hard as well and the worker but which boss do you think is the hardest? You can let me know in the comments underneath. I find Lilindre easier with Cyrus and you can fight her with him in normal mode and that's once you've reached level 25 and beaten her with Issa. 
so stay tuned for more Deathless Bosses Down. Thanks for watching Tamil Channel, your favourite channel for Infinity Blade. If you enjoyed the video, please like, comment and subscribe and check out my website and social pages. Thanks, see you next time.